All right, question four. We're getting there. his first name? Was it A? He was actually a young boy posing as an adult man, and she thought he should make that clear to people. <laughs> <laughs> was it B? Frederick was Celia's name for the slugs who ate her plants, and she would not be having any friends with that name. <laughs> was it C? He only painted childs, better known as children. <laughs> what was it D? She felt the unique name child, spelled with an E at the end, so the name of a word, would give him a level of prestige worthy of his talent. Who thinks it was that one? <laughs> yep. You guys are doing great. <laughs> Question five, why was the tower on Appledore built? Was it A, it wasn't built, it was constructed, okay? <laughs> was it B, for a reenactment of the Lord of the Rings, the two towers? <laughs> It didn't go well because Celia refused to play Gandalf. <laughs> Not a team player. Was it C? During World War II, it was constructed by the Navy to install radar technology to survey the waters for German U boats. <laughs> Please don't preemptively answer. <laughs> or was it D? The giant living on Appledore wanted something to relate to. <laughs> Thanks, James. Who <laughs> <laughs> thinks it was C, the World War II thing? Yeah. Everyone who came to Appledore today knew yeah. that one. <laughs> Question six What is a shirt? A. A shy bird. <laughs> B. A short word. <laughs> C. A shirt is a feeling of confidence. Uh, like you can be a shirt. That I have a PhD. <laughs> ceramic pottery commonly and mistakenly referred to as a shard. <laughs> How serious. Shard is the word for a broken piece of ceramic pottery. <laughs> Please Google it. It will say sometimes referred to as a shard. So funny. <laughs> Question seven. Why were Karen's built back in the fishing era? Do you all know what those are? Piles of rocks. Piles of rocks. A. To make seagulls feel important. <laughs> Enthusiasts out here working together with pile enthusiasts. <laughs> C. They aided sailors in navigating the islands when they are out in their boats. 
or D. They were monuments honoring all the English muffins that first settled on the island. <laughs> I guess we'll never know. Let's see. Is the answer? They aided sailors navigating the islands. I always thought they were just art. No. Functional. This is my last question. How did Celia? May I have sat in the classroom, please? <laughs> <laughs> How did Celia once describe a little girl she met on lunch? And A, she was lovely and fair. Mm. <laughs> Her smile was as bright as the weathered sand around her. Mm. <laughs> was it C? It was a little girl of about six or seven years old, but she was a little monster. <laughs> she was dressed in a flaming pink calico gown, and over her shoulders tumbled a thicket of dull, carrot red hair, which looked as if it had never seen a comb. So dry, so rough, so knotted and tangled. It was hideous. Her flat, yellowish face was smeared with molasses. And its ugly, dough color mottled with large, shapeless freckles. She had the eyes of a little pig. Small, pale blue orbs with red rims. And she opened her broad, expressionless mouth and uttered some words which I vainly strove to understand. I really began to wonder if she were not some dreadful little gnome sprung up out of the air at my feet. Was it D? <laughs>